I think uh, I would like to thank uh, ITU for organizing this uh, uh, summit. Uh, technology has advanced, but now, and, and coverage is everywhere. But now, what we miss are digital skills and digital literacy. Otherwise, um, uh, people have uh, uh, the spaces all covered with technology, but now people need to appreciate and know how to utilize that technology. And that's, for, and that's why we are here now, to bridge that gap. That with this adverse technology, is everybody adopting to it? Do they have the skills? Do they have the digital literacy to utilize what is uh, around them? And, and, and that's why this, uh, this summit is very, very important. And my country, Uganda, is one of the countries where ITU has established uh, the Digital Transformation Center to skill the young people so that they can adopt as fast as possible and utilize the, the existing technology. And, 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 and that's why we are here, to tell the whole world that ITU is assisting us and we are doing very well. There are so many innovations now coming up in my country because of that uh, digital skilling uh, 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 center so that we can really move with the whole world as far as technology is concerned. And then later, after these young people have acquired the skills, we now go to the rural areas to, to, to scale up, to scale up whatever we have innovated and also train the rural population to also adopt to the use of uh, of uh, the current uh, technology as far as uh, digital, uh, digital transformation is concerned. Because government is digitizing everything. We are, going, we are now uh, going e-government, e-taxation, e-health, and, and everything is now e. But the population is still not yet vast with the use of uh, the different technologies uh, around us. You might be having a mobile phone, but probably the only thing you can do is to ring and send a message. But what about applying for a passport online? Can you do it? What about um, transacting with the bank uh, you, you, you using the e-technology? Can you do it? And, and, and what about creating jobs? Uh, 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 using the, 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 the digital space which is around. Can you do it? So now, I think here we are trying, we are coming here as leaders, policy makers, the academia, uh, the private sector, to see how now we can bridge this gap so that all of us in the world can move at the same pace. The Western world has advanced. I'm here in Bahrain. It's, it's an amazing country. Everything is digitized. I even applied for my visa online and I received it when I was still in Uganda. I was not disturbed at the airport. Everything was so systematic. But we want the whole world to catch up, uh, to catch up that, uh, that, that fever so that we move at the same time. So that's why we are here and I'm very grateful for this uh, forum. And uh, it's also a follow-up on what we held in Uganda recently, the um, Global Summit of Regulators. So for me, as now a policymaker, as a minister of government, we are trying to see how we can ease the regulations so that uh, the digital environment is more friendly to everybody, to the academia to the business community, to, to, uh, to the private sector, uh, uh, and, and, and so that we can even attract investment, more investment in, uh, in the digital space. And, and that's, why, that's why we are here. But we are very, very grateful.